They'll be calling you a radical. Video 2012. That was my best year ever. Why? Because that's the year I survived fucking leukemia. But I want to talk about... Now hear me out. Stay with me on this thing. All This is really, really important. They've thrown up their hands. Now the looting that's gone on on the revivification at Savannah River and the fucking ships bringing in. Why would they be using fucking English ships? Because who owns us? We're the Queens, bitch. Come on. The fucking nuclear thesis. Now hear me out on this. There's a bunch of information in this video. Now the Sturgeons right up the road here. My, you know, I lived close to the Snake River. Eighty of them. Fuck. They're prehistoric. That's all of them. We're talking extinction. You know, their food. They're, Look, it's like everybody's gone after me the whole time and saying, hey, they're all dying, they're dying. You know, we're going to form another commission. We're going to spend billions of dollars, fucking trillions of dollars, marine biologists, whatever. They're fucking simply starving to death. It's all starvation. The fucking ocean's collapses. I used to get stuff sent to me on an event along the Pacific Ocean once a week. Some, you know, group of animals dying is just going on. Then, you know, as of late, it's been once a day. The last couple of weeks, it's been fucking hourly. This is a major, right here, right now, the major fucking collapse of the greatest ecosystem of work. This is the greatest event in human history. So at the very same, same time, so the nuclear industry was over. They were fucking done. The giant experiment, but they still have all the subsidy. You know, the fucking taxpayer subsidy. So Barack Obama, these are the incredible crimes that he's committed. These incredible crimes that he's committed. You know, the whole fucking group of this nuclear fucking cartel is committed. So... Now, hear me out on this. Savannah River's been the only one that got a license. Now, Blue Castle came very close to get a license. I put the dagger to Blue Castle. One person. One person. Google Blue Castle. Especially on YouTube. See what you get. You're going to get me on a lot of this stuff. But, look. Savannah River was put in place because the nuclear industry was done in 86. Post Chernobyl. You know, don't you like, oh, they're putting sarcophagus over fucking Chernobyl. What? Oh, fuck. 30 fucking years later. So... Oh, we got Arriva, Arriva, French. The French own fucking fucking nuclear rats. Now, by the way, there's a fucking reactor that's been shut down that the police have surrounded in Belgium. Remember it? Class in 69, 19 fucking 70. You got a, how many hijackings were there a week in this country? You know, Palestinians usually fucking, we're going to fly it into a nuclear reactor. Remember? They're ticking time bombs, every fucking one of them. So, they got revivification, right? That's saving the nuclear industry. We all fuck. You're full of shit. So that's how they built Savannah River. Hundred billion dollars fucking in looting just since Obama took office. So they shipped it where? They shipped it where? To Japan? We fought it tooth and nail in fucking the early 90s. We're like, fuck you, you're lying, you ain't got no reification. They were lying the whole time. Now think about it. Livermore, the city out there, spends trillions and trillions of dollars. Cal Berkeley, fucking Los Alamos, all these fucking serfdom rats because they think comfortability is the fucking zenith of life. That's why they have a major fucking suicide rate out there. It's a whole city. They spent trillions and trillions of dollars. Fairy tale. They don't work. They don't do anything. They've never had it. They'll never have it. It's just a fairy tale. So now they've thrown up their hands and admitted it. They shipped it all over there. 13 fucking tons of plutonium to Moxville, which we knew that was number three. Now I want to hear me out on this. How did they learn the cover of Fukushima? November 2nd, 1978. There was a fucking nuclear accident at Fukushima Daiichi in unit number three. That's right. There was a lot of talk among our groups or whatever. We fucking kind of all knew it. But it was never reported to the international community officially till when? 2007? 29 years. That's right. That's right. So they have, they've been covering up fucking nuclearism since Hiroshima and Nagasaki. Nobody even really knows how fucking desecrated that fucking island Japan was. And the, fuck, the art that they painted, whatever, fucking still blackballed by the New York establishment fucking museums. Kind of like mine. So, they've thrown up their hands. Now, I reported this a long time ago. Now, you guys, you know, they're bringing it in with fucking ships into Savannah River, South Carolina. But I already know they already happened. Now they're going to take it to Whip in New Mexico. I thought Whip had an explosion. I talked to a guy in California. He says, I did the drawings originally on fucking Whip, you know, way back in the day. And they never built Whip. And I said, what are you talking about? Of course they built Whip. Well, they never, I said, fuck it. They use it every day. The fucker blew up. You do know it blew up plutonium container. Plutonium. Which I reported that first too. <coughs> so they've thrown their hands up. They know. Then they have, this is the only thing that's keeping this fucking evil, fucking sickening, fucking fell technology, fucking mass murder, kill the fucking world, fuck technology. So 
Now think about this. Obama, with an executive order, 2012, writing our second election, threw another $30 billion at it when they already knew it was failed. He threw $30 billion at it before. $100 billion Obama's thrown it. Now why would he be throwing $100 billion when he knows it failed? When Liverpool, because they're looting on the fucking way out. Now, Kostakistan. Now hear me out. When the deer and the antelope fuck, remember when all the, half the herd just dropped dead and I could prove it? They had a nuclear accident over there. That's what fucking killed them. They all dropped fucking dead. Now, Toshiba, Westinghouse, and the state-owned piece of fucking Kostakistan. Why Kostakistan? Because that's where they're trying to do fucking the, monetize the nuclear waste. That's what I'm fighting here in Utah, dirty Herbie. Fucking all I think. So, this whole fucking thing is just because it's free fucking money. So Clinton has this foundation in Canada who's set up through fucking Hillary and the Times, New York Times and Washington Post working together on a fucking piece about this fucking money. He took the fucking bribe, 40 fucking million from the, who's now the president of Kazakhstan. That's what this is all about. They like to monetize, you know, little fucking shiny fucking, I like all you guys, gold, 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 when the gold, who, the Rothschilds and the fucking queen created the gold standard. Gold's common as fuck. It's not finite. It's everywhere. Same with diamonds, same with silver. They like to create wealth out of nothing. Now they're doing it with fucking plutonium as they kill the fucking earth. So uh, these are the incredible crimes that Obama committed. I mean, why, why do you know everybody now, Gina McCarthy like Flint, Michigan? Now, if this was that rat fucking piece of shit Bush, we would have crucified him on Flint, Michigan. Why does Obama get him? Where's the, what does that fucker do? He's president of the United States. Why is no one called this piece of shit out? Same with Gina McCarthy, the head of the EPA. Why do they get carte blanche? Why do these fuckers, you know, these sitting in the United States there, why do they get fucking, I, I love it how you just let him fucking off the hook on this. $100 billion of Savannah River when they knew it was a failure, so they've agreed to fucking ship it back. 13 fucking tons of fucking plutonium. Where are they going to put it? That's the whole point. So these nuclear reactors are fucking stored up waste all over the ticking fucking down months. There's nowhere to fucking put it. So they, they make more of it every day. We don't use any of it. It just gets more and more and more. And look, the American, look, fuck these contemporary fucking sheep. They're fucking morons. I named it here. Like, fuck these people who are in fucking the United States. Fuck them. And this Jim Stone fucking lunatic. Fucking this, that guy dude needs to go fucking to a fucking doctor. He's mentally ill. And the people that follow him are mentally ill. To say it because it's against personal fucking relationships. It's about no personal accountability. You, know, you say, oh, it's all caused by the Jews did it. Fuck, how easy when we build nuclear reactors where fucking tsunamis and earthquakes happen. To say that it was all man, it's no, 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 no. Building the reactor there. We've all fucking known this, the fucking experimental island. To sit and say, oh, they just, no, 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 no. Fucking night point earthquakes happen. Happened here in the United States not that long ago. What, 59? That one Alaska? Tsunamis kill people. Oh, we didn't have two nuclear reactors in California there, did we? If we that same earthquake happened, which happened in 1959 here, we would have fucking evacuated the entire fucking thing. Now, I know for a fact that inside there are many people inside the fucking NRC and inside that know that wanted to evacuate all of Oregon. Because those hypocrites are so fucking gone. The Neil, I mean, this is that fucking pathetic, ignorant fucking populace. Now, who gives a fuck about them? Fucking use your fucking tiny few fucking smart, dynamic fucking people. They're going to take this nuclear giant to the fucking ground. Now, they're bringing it in, and they're saying their shit, DOE has, by law, has to release it. They released it. I fucking talked about it. They have to fucking tell you where it's going. It's going to New Mexico, they said. Whoops, closed. So where do they got? They got a secret facility at fucking Los Alamos? Who knows? But I know, because I've been, fucking whistleblowers have been telling me, it's been leaking out. Fuck, they're taking it to Texas, they're taking it here to Utah. Fuck, they're just burying it in the fucking ground. I mean, wow. And they want to monetize it. And they want a fucking Western initiative for nuclear, nuke fucking scale, these fucking rats, these fucking, and you're going to just let them off the fucking hook. The sturgeon fucking dying, they're prehistoric ancient. Just, it, 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 that's an extinction event on them. The Pacific Ocean is the greatest ecological, it's right here, right now, happening right here today. No politicians talking about it. Nobody's talking about it. The fucking greatest collapse in fucking any ecosystem in the history of humanity, and you don't think it matters because, oh, you're going to live forever and you contemporize fucking, but I don't even know what these people are fucking chasing. I don't even know what the fuck they're up to and they're weirdo. There's a fucking advertisement going on the NCA sleeve for right now. You guys find it. I need you to find it for me. They're talking about the sea turtles. And these, this guy, he's talking to his friends, walking around. Yeah, he says, I saw the sea turtles giving birth and eggs, which is a, that's a fucking special moment fucking anyone who's ever seen it. And these people are just falling down dead. Like, ah, fuck you, environment. Ah. They're just falling. Well, that's what they're going to do. They're going to fall down dead from cancer. At the exact same time, 445 fucking sea turtles washed up dead in southwest fucking Mexico last week. 
So think about this culture. Because you're, you're that fucking arrogant. These people, the average person, <laughs> bro, I don't know, fuck you. You fucking sheep, get back in your pan, you stupid, dumb fucking sheep. And quit fucking putting your stupid fucking... I mean, I want the good comments, where they... But these people come in, oh, fuck, I don't do Fukushima. But fuck, who cares what you do? Go fucking die, rat! We don't give... I don't give a fuck about you. I'm fighting for my children, my graduate. You fucking Canepers rat, who's ever been told right in your face, who don't give a fuck, don't get... You don't deserve to live, you don't deserve anything. Fuck your pieces of shit. And I like all you gods will, like Paul Bagley. I'll probably, if that fucker's a prophet, I'm a fucking asteroid. Everything, look, Mark gonna crash. Everything he says is completely the opposite fucking wrong. Remember Jade Helm? Remember the fucking meteor? Remember this? Everything he fucking... Because I want to ask every one of you fuckers that go along with this fucking Paul Bagley, this fucking Lisa Havens, this fucking every one of these fucking... I want to ask you one thing. If it's all God's will, oh, and it's one family, Illuminati got a thing, and they're getting fucking, we're going to get our gun, fuck, check, if it's all God, then why the fuck did God put you on earth? For you to suck air and earth crawl? Take the analysis of the analysis and just recently, you ruined this fucking genre, you're pathetic. You're fucking pigs, all of you, and your life's meaningless anyway. You, you know, you might make a fucking few thousand dollars on your fucking, you know, AdSense account. Who gives a fuck? Woo-hoo! Your fucking hypothesis, your thesis, your art, your fucking, will never stand in time. It's pathetic. You're just wasting your time. This guy that stands in California in his fucking kitchen court, that guy's even more pathetic. I mean, all God's will. Earth-sucking, earth-crawling, fucking contemporary fucking goats who fucking make me want to fucking puke. Fuck them! Fuck them! I've seen them when they get cancer, they die so fucking fast, it's pathetic. They think they know it, they don't know shit. They're pathetic. You know? Same old, same old, same old, same old. This is a big fucking story. <coughs> They're done. They're admitting it's done. But they're looting. They're going to park these old pieces of shit off the side of the fucking road. These big fucking stories. Right here, right fucking now. I'm the only one that's fucking ever told this in detail from the fucking the thing. And I don't give a fuck what you think of me. I could give a fuck. Or sucking fucking goats. Fucking, eh, seriously. All God's will. One family. Illuminati. Then why the fuck are you on earth? Why? What is the meaning of your life? God just stuck you here to suck air and earth crawl? Ah, I don't, I mean... Wow, what a test. You failed it, motherfuckers. So, they've thrown up their hands and given up. It's a big, big fucking story. Really thrown up in their hands and given up. That's the only thing that kept on alive. The nuclear industry, it's the only thing that kept alive. And now they just fucking, it went on way, way too long. And now more and more waste. And they're just looting because they got all the taxpayer money. You know what Price Anderson is? And they're not public utilities. They're the same old players. By the way, Steve Chinese Jobs' wife owns a lot of them. Fucking Bill Gates owns a lot of them. Fucking Al Gore owns fucking a lot of them. Fucking uh, a lot of these evangelical church leaders. I think Joel Steen owns fucking part of them. A lot of the old bankers that fucking Goldman Sachs owns fucking Indian Point. You know, it's the same old fucking players. It's free fucking money. Huge fucking free money. It's the big fucking story. This fucking collapses on. God's will. Well, I got news for you. You're fucking, you know, 99% of you fuckers are just going to be sucked into a black hole anyway. You think fucking God, you're special God, God fucking hates you. How could he not? If you believe in that thesis, Tim Shell out and you just come down here to spin and say it's all God's will, they're sucking earth crawl, fucking good luck to you. That isn't the fucking plan. Never was the fucking plan. I don't care what fucking you believe in. You're pieces of fucking shit. Pieces of fucking air sucking scum. Now, there's fucking plenty of people that are good fucking people. And, you know, but we're in the minority. You know, fight on fucking try. That's what we're doing here. The rest of these fainty goats, let them go into their fucking freak show. Because they're so fucking disconnected, they're fucking clueless in this fucking contemporary freak show that we fucking live in. Fucking United States consumes 38% of the world's GDP, makes up less than 3%. Consume, obey, consume, obey. You know, oh, it's not their fault. Fuck you, it's not their fault. Fuck you. Stay in tune.